Chenye Glasses was first established in the year 1992 and today we have come to their flagship store in Jiafang Bay. In 2019, they entered into partnership with the Sichuan Institute of Fine Arts to create the Chenye Arts Museum. So let's go inside and learn more about the history and future of glasses. Our story begins with this test frame right in front of me and you know in the past how every decade has kind of been represented by a different colour but this one here reminds me a lot of the hippie culture of the 1990s just the way that it combines the bold and avant-garde colours and actually stood in front of this model it reminds me of an old-fashioned kit that you would find around that time Down here we have a seat where visitors can come and sit down and when you do this you can sit back, relax, think back into the past and also try to imagine what the retro atmosphere of the 1990s would have been like. Now this piece of artwork in front of me here reminds me a lot of a saxophone. So we all know the rich and affectionate sounds that saxophones make. So having one of these in the store definitely adds some romance. One of the things I like about it is the way that it breaks spatial confines. So if you look upwards, we can see how the main tube goes up through what would be the roof and then across into the second floor. And other features I like as well are these industrial like piping. And to come to think of it, this model also reminds me a little bit of an upside down periscope. The eyes are the most important sensory organ of the human body and their performance far outstrips any optical device that has ever been invented. We use them to perceive the world around us and we can also use them to convey our emotions. However, there is one indispensable prerequisite. There must be light. Behind me, this piece of red artwork is modelled on the novel coronavirus. But at the end of each spike, there is a wide-angle mirror that is normally used for road safety. During the pandemic, every aspect and detail of our lives has been infinitely magnified. But at the same time, this has hopefully allowed us to view life from more perspectives and will help us readjust our relationship with life following the pandemic. The Chinia Art Museum was first opened in April 2019 and the second phase of the exhibition then opened in June 2020. Every day, thousands of tourists flock here to come and take pictures and the overall number of tourists has increased by a factor of five. 